Good morning, everybody. This is the most exciting moment for me. You see my kayak on the roof of my Mini Cooper. I thought it was twice as big. Not exactly. I think I know what anti-lock brakes sound like. <laughs> anyway, I'm at the Rosie the Riveter Visitor Center waiting for my kayak partner. It's an absolute gorgeous day. It's so perfect. Um, when I left the house, the wind was three knots, which is just as much as a little breeze. Keep you cooled off. My little friend is already in trouble. She's late. Okay, I'm at Point Melante. If you pay attention to my videos, uh, you'll know my goal is to go to that shipwreck right there. Hopefully we're gonna make it under the bridge. It's uh, the highest tide coming down. So the water's just going out. We're gonna start from that corner, go around it, and land over here, in theory. So, we left Iron Man's car here, and we're gonna take my boat around the corner to the Pirate Cove. Okay. Say hello, Iron Man. Hello, bad kitty. <laughs> so, we're ready to go. I got my walkie-talkie, so when we go on land, we are on here, Point San Pablo. We're gonna go around here into where the car originally is, where I said earlier, in theory. Okay, this is Point San Pablo, Pirate Harbor, and we're about ready to go into a channel that looks very much a lot more waves and wind and all that, but apparently there is a ship right under here. It looks like it's part of it. Whoa, Nelly. We got Iron Man over here. So, this is what it looks like. So someday I just want to go from that side and this way or vice, you know, around the other way. So, we're gonna make a U-turn. We're gonna go inside the, the Pirate Harbor. This was made by ships, so all these were lined up and they put dirt over the top. Pretty wild. Got uh, Iron Man up there paddling. We're going through what used to be, I believe, the whaling station Chinese camp. Not the Chinese camp over there, on the other side of the bay. So uh, let's take our time going through this little thing and look at it and take pictures. But this, my friends, is Point San Pablo. Once we get around that corner, then we're around the corner. That made a lot of sense, didn't it? So far she said she'll kayak with me again, but we're not done. <laughs> it's probably like we're going straight for a thing. What? Hey, turn around and say hi, Iron Man. Hi. So far so good, my friends. It took us long enough to get in the water. Yes. Okay, slow down. I want to um, take some photos. Clear the... This is also where Blood Alley was shot with John Wayne and what was the gal? Lauren Bacall. Lauren Bacall. Okay, look at those tides coming in. I do believe a, um, a ship just went by. Out here it's like really deep, so we're probably not gonna go in the channel, but it's all gonna push us towards the, the bridge, so we're good. We'll just stay over here. You wanna um, paddle us out that way a little bit so we don't crash up against these? Oh my God, we got white cats coming. Let's go straight into it. Okay, here we go. Let's see how we do. I forgot to shut off the... <sighs> okay, we just survived. I don't know if you can see the waves, but they were pretty gnarly white caps. So that island over there, I thought that red buoy was on my bucket list, but yeah, no. I'm just gonna call it on that one. So there's where we were. And there's the Richmond Bridge. 
This is gonna be easy peasy. Yeah, you wanna try to go to that? Let's uh sure. <laughs> East Brother Lighthouse. East Brothers Lighthouse. Yes, you can actually stay there. It's bed and breakfast. Yeah. Is he trolling? See look at those white caps coming. Yeah. I like to see the stuff on the sides. Well, I don't know. Let's get to this little point up here and then look straight across to see if we could do it. Okay. She's game. <laughs> right, no. Okay, slow down, slow down. Okay, let's get some footage. We decided that it's a little rough out there in that channel and even though you think I'm a risk taker, um, just the very fact of being here is risky. I'm not gonna um, do that. Damn it, it's so close. Maybe earlier today when it was a lot smoother. Okay, so here you want to use your paddle to kind of push off things instead of paddling sometimes. She says she likes it. We're like in the middle of Universal Studios where the thing caught on fire. Look at this dog. So I believe this was all a whaling station. Yeah. Okay, this is gonna be trouble. <laughs> How cool is that? No, we're not at Disneyland. We're right here in San Pablo Point. There's stuff like this in Oakland. It's awesome. Honestly, this is the shit I live for. That. Back there. So oh. what do you think? Tell us your opinion, Ironman. I love it. Have you ever seen anything like this? Not up close like this, because I no. haven't been in this kind of boat before. All right. Yeah, I love it. Yeah, see, if we were in a motorboat, you can't go in here like this. Whoa! Yeah, that's all right. As long as it's not a canvas boat. So, see the little island? Let me do that. <laughs> this is a little unnerving. See that thing, if we grab onto it, possibly could fall on us. So, we gotta be very careful. But look over here. very hard to make a u-turn in these things so it's forward or backwards I live for this stuff I just love this yep it's my boat I could scratch it okay stand by yeah, there's all kinds of little things. Boat again. Oh, oh, it's kind of wanna, um, Actually, I think this side would be a little better, but that, I'm really worried about that big one that's cracked. Can you see this side you mean over here? Um, no, left side. On the left? Okay. Yeah, there's some on, but you see the roof oh, there? Yes, that's awesome. Yes, so we got to go. You guys, you no. know, if you just see that, don't touch. Yeah. Okay. I won't touch anything about that. See? Yeah. She talks no sense into me. Normal people would say, I think we should go out there. But we should really get past these white balls first. White caps. They're going to be pretty gnarly. I would love you to see this part, but I really need both my hands. Okay, we're going to be doing the Macarena. Let's do it. All right? Yep, we're ready. I'm going to let you paddle and I'm just going to um, videotape and steer. Okay. And you're ready. Go, go for it. Although I hear another boat. Okay, I'm going to turn sharp. 
Okay, I'm gonna do the macarena. Put her head. Yep. Get that stuff. Okay, you can just slow down. Enjoy, enjoy the moment, our death-defying moment. Slow down. Relax. Okay, now we're getting some pipe situation. Okay, slow down, stop. Okay, big old boat. It's gonna leave us a gnarly wave. And we made it out of that docky area. Whoa, Nelly. <laughs> you're a good uh, co-pilot over here, my friend. Just saying, you're brave or stupid. <laughs> they go so well together. They do, they do. <laughs> Um, and uh, that was a pretty scary scenario, but it was fun. That's gonna be like the birds. There's all these birds flying above us right now. I'm sorry, that's my fault. We're going sideways. All right. It actually would be better to have gloves with fingers just for these kind of little scenarios. Okay, that's what we went under. There was a building on top of that. I didn't see that part. But okay. here, here comes a big old barge. How cool is that? Wow. You want to see how close we can get to it? It's pretty. <laughs> what? She said no to something. Come on. Just halfway. Okay. Look, it's it's calm. There's no boats. Oh yeah, okay. Fine. Fine. I'm hey look, more kayakers. Oh yes. Okay. I just want to get the barge. All right, let's get out of this guy's way. He's going to be a... We're getting swept into here. Can yeah. you see the current? Yeah. Let's uh, get around it quick. And next thing you know, it, you're in some weird current. And that looked just really weird. So this, I think this is a Chevron dock, but it's unused or unbeing used. The military used uh, the port around the corner as a, a feeling station in the military. And I got that scared look. She don't, she can't see it. <laughs> but I think she got the I love this. You know, right now we're not even paddling and we're just kind of drifting. So, and we're all drifting towards uh, our location. So, once again, the captain has made the right decisions on what to do and what time to do it. I do get a little dyslexic about it, but we, uh, we, we are just floating in our direction. Where in the world am I? My friends, I am at what was known as the world's largest winery in America. Not in, I'm sorry, not in America, in the world. I know that's hard to believe, but right there, Wine Haven, California. In, uh, during Prohibition, it went out of business because, you know, you can't drink wine because it has alcohol in it. So then the military used this base to uh, fill a, as a filling station for their ships. So we're gonna try to get as close as we can and uh, take some pictures. Yep, that's right. 12 years, largest in the world. Wine Haven, California, read my blog, postcardtravelers.com. Okay. We have the boat there and uh, we're going up this little road to see Wine Haven. So far, we haven't been arrested. But, my friends, this castle right here is Wine Haven, California. My personal feeling, they should bring it back. That is quite a feat to say in the world, right? Mm -hmm. So what do you think of your little adventure today? I love it so far. Cover that. No. <laughs>
<laughs> oh look, an open door. You wanna go inside? Anybody home? Hi. I think I can make it. <laughs> All right, here we go. Whoa, there's a big drop. That's security, she's talking too much. So now we are inside taking our own tour. You didn't lock the gate? Or did you? I told a little white lie. I told these people I didn't know where we're at only because I didn't know if we were gonna get in trouble or not. So, there you go. Played dumb. So if you're one of them and you happen to hear this, just understand we didn't wanna get arrested. Okay, we're back inside. Wine Haven. You can get a permit and actually come here, apparently. We're pirates. We came from the ocean. We didn't know the rules. We're being followed. We're going to go up these stairs. And we're going to go on the roof. Go with me. Let's see. Let's see. Definitely. I want to get up there. She thinks I shouldn't. She's worried about me now. Look at that. This, my friends. I'm doing this so you don't have to. Postcardtravelers.com, fan me baby. Okay, I think we are officially lost. I don't see a way down other than an elevator shaft that's been out of service for since the 1800s. Of course, that's where the military left the nuclear warhead. Okay, right, so we went up this out of its service area. Now we're going out onto the roof with you. I love it. That's crazy. Yeah, that's what we're talking about. Where in the world am I? Oh, Wine Haven, California. Look at that. I'm on a castle. We kayaked all the way from over there. Pretty cool. We're on the roof. Okay, we're in trouble now. Security told us to get off the roof. Somebody told us we can come up here, so there you go. Bye. Having lunch. Karen, i.e. Iron Man. Made lunch. Now we have to eat and run. <laughs> Literally, we're in trouble. So we gotta get past the gate because they can't stop us. Our boat's on the beyond the fence. There was no signs that said we couldn't come in. So there you go. Okay, we got our souvenirs. We didn't get arrested, although we are being followed by the cops. I don't know what she's doing. I'm just, I'm just <laughs> she's hiding. Oh God! See, she's ducking the P PD. The PO, what do they call them? Okay, we made it. We were gonna go to that island. We're a little worn out after being chased by the cops. So we're just gonna go under the bridge to say we did. Go around those little rocks. I can't remember what they're called, still rocks, I think. Down there to my shipwreck and call it a day. It's been awesome. It's pretty cool. It's the Richmond Bridge, my friends. They used to move cars over here to that, here, and there's ships over there that have been uh, buried 200 feet long, and um, we're going to go over there, but seal, well, first we're going to see these seal areas, and we have to say we've been under the Richmond Bridge because it's just too cool. But once the bridge was done, they had no use for the dock, so now it's all dilapidated. All right, there it is, friends. Is that fucking awesome? I love it. Fucking love it. 
whatever it is. This is the shit I'm talking about right here. Is it scary? Yes, it's scary. But I'm not gonna die alone. I got my friend and so far I think she's still gonna kayak with me again. There's the seal. Look, there's two of them popping up. I'm gonna try to stay far away from them. And then that is the, what do you call it? Chevron. So, I've kayaked on the other side of that and now I've done all this. Okay, I say proceed cautiously. You gotta watch, you know, okay. it's okay if we bump something, but. Right. Yeah. See, that would have been on my bucket list over there, but too far. Uh huh. That's cute. Okay. Hello. She's the one with the food. <laughs> he snarled at you. They're not happy. We're getting a little bit too close to their environment. Okay. Are we coming back around? Yes. Yep. We'll go straight ahead so we don't go down the middle. There's oh my god, look how many over there. Yeah, let's go straight that way. Oh shit, look at them all go in the water. Yeah. Those are little ones, not like the elephant seals. Yeah. I got them, we're surrounded. Yeah. They're behind me. Yeah. yeah. Are you nervous? Yeah, look at how many of them are. Yeah. Holy shit, they're all coming this way. But why are they coming so I don't know, they heard you had a sandwich. I No, 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 leave that thing. Are you kidding? Hide that. <laughs> Don't show them the sandwich. Shit, let's get out of here. Do you think we can tell what a sandwich is? Uh, animals have better senses than we do. Okay, we Clearly, they don't... There's like 90 of them. All looking at them. Dude, keep paddling. <laughs> <laughs> oh, they're going underwater. Yes, gently. Holy shit. There's one right here. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna go. Okay. We're being followed. Okay, are you nervous? No. She just don't know what she's up against. That's why. Can you believe she was gonna pull out a sandwich and there's like 90 freaking seals there? I was kidding. <laughs> we would have been attacked. You're lucky they didn't smell that shit. Ah, that was exciting. So now we're going back this way. There's a little fixer upper over there if you want to buy it. And for the climax of my trip, a shipwreck right here. That is so badass. Freaking love this. Okay. I'm just going to say, friends, that right there is awesome. I want to thank my friend Karen, i.e. Iron Man, for being such a great co-pilot, making a great lunch. Are you going to do it again? Yeah. Yay! She sang it in the water, folks. You heard it. That's right. I'm putting you on my calendar. So, um, how cool is this? I wish I knew the name of it, but, uh... That is just outstanding. So, postcardtravelers.com, fan me baby. And November 15th, I'm going to be at Lungamars at Jack London Square with a photography show. Hopefully, so far, that's what the plan is. Good night. Happy sailing. If you're wondering what this little house is, is it's where the captain, I believe, Tells everybody what to do. How cool is that? It actually continues on. 
I think this one's 180 feet, and there's one under here that's 200 feet. There's three of them. You can see them from Google Earth. I think we're done. So we're at Point Melante Beach, and we're going home. So Iron Man over here plays rugby, so she took me to this bar. What's it called? What's it called, this bar? Up and Under. Up and Under. That's a rugby player, girls. She can arm wrestle. Since I have a gimp right now, I'm not going to arm wrestle her. But I will take her down. And for the record, this is the path we went. We started here, went around here, all the way to there. That's the, where the wine haven was. That's where the little seals were. And that's where the shipwreck's at. Right there. Awesome. Peace out.